In search of the Northern Lights, there is a quiet village on the ice field of Greenland, which is covered in thick snowflakes all year round, and for six months the village does not have a sunrise, the sky makes a roaring sound, followed by beautiful auroras. Whenever he heard this magical sound, Pete would always run to the empty snowfield, he raised his head and waited for the aurora to appear, again and again, year after year, Pete was curious to know where this sound, this light came from, and this curiosity became heavier and heavier. Today was Pete's 12th birthday, and he felt that age meant he was old enough to do what he wanted to do. So when a familiar voice appeared, he embarked on a journey to find the Northern Lights. Pete climbed to the top of the mountain, where it was white, the sky was blocked by white fog, and the sound was far away, but no light could be seen in the sky. He still waited at the top of the mountain for a long, long time until an ice wolf came to him. It bit the corner of Pete's clothes and tugged hard, as if to say follow me, Pete followed the ice wolf down the mountain to an ice field he had never been to, and at this time, the ice wolf ran away, leaving Pete alone. Disillusioned, Pete brings out his birthday present, a wishing ball that will glow. I make a wish to you every year on my birthday, but it never comes true. Disappointed, Pete buried the wishing ball in snow. That's when something magical happened. With a booming sound, a green light appeared in the sky, and Pete looked up, feeling that this voice, this light, was beside him. The ice wolf looked at the happy Pete from a distance, and then quietly left. Back in the village, Pete tells everyone about his adventure, but of course no one really believes him. Strangely since then, every twelfth birthday, the children of the village have planted wishing balls on the ice field. <laughs>